you are looking for a good quality moisturizer and you are looking into getting the Laneige Radiant C Cream. Perfect because in today's video, I'll be sharing my review. What are its benefits? The application. Is it worth it? If you want to know more, keep on watching. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Tara and welcome to another skincare vlog. I have been using the Laneige Radiancy Cream for almost three months now. So I believe it is time for a review. By the way, if you guys are into skincare, make sure to subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified whenever I have new videos just like this. Also, if you have any questions, please feel free to drop a comment down below. By the way, for your reference, I have combination to oily skin. All right, so let us get right into it. Let us get to know the Laneige Radiancy Cream. Laneige Radiant C Cream. Empowered by dual vitamins, Radiant C delivers radiant, bright skin in just two weeks. Recommended for avid smartphone users. If you are stressed out from long working hours and if you enjoy daily outdoor activities. The Laneige Radiant C Cream strength lies in its ability to provide deep moisturization. Dermatologically tested, non-comedogenic tested, and hypoallergenic tested. As to the application, I only use this every night because as you can see, and I'm telling you right now based on my experience that it feels kind of watery and greasy at the same time, which I don't mind in the evening. I like it that way because I want my skin to feel really hydrated. So I got this from the Laneige official store in Lazada. It retails at 1,600 pesos and you get 30 ml and this is good for 12 months once opened. So as what I've mentioned, I have been using this for three months already. So from that, I am guessing that this would probably be good for about six months if you only use it once a day but if you use it three i mean if you use it twice a day then of course this would only last for about three months three to four months and now moving on to the pros and cons of this product the things i like and dislike okay i'm gonna go right ahead with the things that i like about the Laneige Radiancy Cream. First and foremost, it has vitamin C and E as its main ingredients. Vitamin C benefits. As an antioxidant, it protects skin cells from free radicals caused by UV exposure. It reduces melanin production, which helps to lighten hyperpigmentation and brown spots, even out skin tone and enhance skin radiance helps repair damage from sun exposure and collagen loss by boosting healthy cell turnover and regeneration. Vitamin E benefits. It helps treat hyperpigmentation, helps slow down the aging process and prevents wrinkles. And it also treats acne scarring. Vitamin C and E, really great ingredients in one bottle. So I did a little bit of research and it truly shows that vitamin C and E help replenish the skin with essential nutrients and topical antioxidants reduces the damaging effects of blue light. Which is one of the benefits that this product is highlighting that it corrects micro dark spots caused by blue light from our smartphones, laptops, tablets, even from fluorescent light and lead light yikes blue light from electronic devices can lead to changes in skin cells including cell shrinkage and death it speeds up the aging process and could lead to pigmentation so if you are always on your phones on your laptops then you definitely need vitamin c and e in your skincare routine and so I looked into the ingredients list. This one has glycerine as well. 
Glycerin acts as a humectant, which is a substance that allows the skin to retain moisture. It can increase skin hydration, relieve dryness, and refresh the skin's surface. If you want to see the rest of the ingredients of the Lynette Radiancy Cream, I'll place their website's link at the description box. Another thing that I like is its texture. It is a cream, but the texture is like a combination of cream and gel. It is a bit mm, jelly, a bit watery, but you could definitely feel that it is a cream. As a person who has combination to oily skin, I would really go for moisturizers or products which have like a jelly texture so then my skin would not feel oily and sticky. And of course, it is readily available online. And I say that because not all good quality products are available here in the Philippines. But with Laneige, it is readily available online. Very convenient. And now for the things I dislike. Okay, number one that I dislike is that it feels kind of oily on my skin. Again, combination to oily skin that is just how my skin responds or reacts to this it is lightweight but i can definitely like feel oiliness a little bit of oiliness which i do not like second is its scent this one has an orangey citrusy scent and it's odd because i usually love that scent but with this it's not really my preference. I checked the ingredients list and this has perfume, but it is way below the ingredients list, which means there's only a little percentage of perfume. So no worries. It really, like for me, it doesn't bother me. It's okay. Another thing I dislike is that it is quite pricey, to be honest. 1,600 pesos, 30 ml only, and it is a cream or moisturizer. I know vitamin C and E are known to be quite expensive ingredients in a product. However, it is a cream or moisturizer. It is not as potent as opposed to having vitamin C and E in a serum. You know what I mean? But then again, it is Laneige and they are known to be quite expensive. And last but not the least, the packaging. It is very nice aesthetically. However, it is very heavy and I don't get it. Why? Is it to protect the vitamin C and E inside? Laneige could probably change the packaging to adjust the price. I like the packaging to be nice yes but at the end of the day i am for what is inside you know what i mean it actually has an applicator which i do not use to be honest is it to avoid contamination should i not be putting my fingers inside the product i don't know let me know maybe you know the answer let me know at the comments below and now for my verdict yay or nay Leave or love? Yay and nay. Love, but leave. Okay, let me explain that. Yay, because of all the good things about this product, as what I've mentioned earlier. And I'm glad that I did not break out while using this product. You could say it worked for me, but it is not for me. The deal breaker for me is that it feels and it is a bit greasy on my skin. And that comment is really based on the skin type that I have. So will I repurchase this? No. However, I do recommend this for those who have normal to dry skin. If you are somebody who is looking into slowly incorporating vitamin C and E, into your skincare routine, if you want protection from blue light, if you want to prevent or treat hyperpigmentation, then I recommend this. Tip, buy it on sale. 
So that is it. I hope you find this video helpful. And if it does, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below if you like the Lanch Radiancy Cream, if you have tried it, if you liked it or not. Let me know your thoughts, guys. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified whenever I have new videos. See you in the next one. Bye!